hi guys Munos here so today's video i am going to do a very brief review on the virtual card that comes with barter by flutterwave it's a nigerian app uh, but i'm going to use the website it's an app that allows you to send money for free across africa and across the world and it also comes with a us dollar virtual card you can use in the us so once you've signed in uh, this is this is how the website looks the app gives you more functionality uh, the website just limits you to basically the card but the app you can send and receive money All right so if you want to fund your account you just simply click on fund butter balance uh, enter in the amount you want to fund in zambia you can only fund it by debit or credit card you can't uh, use a bank transfer from what i've seen so you can save a card or you can use a new card uh, as and when you see fit i've already saved a card that's a uba prepaid kwacha card and you can only load in kwacha okay so once you are here if you let's go straight to the card click on cards and this is my us dollar virtual card it shows you your card number the expiry date and the balance so if you want to see more you can simply scroll up once you've scrolled up you're going to see more information there's a uh, your name the card is only in your name it's not in anybody else's name the card number the cvv code and uh, the billing address this is where people get it wrong use this billing this virtual billing address do not use your address in zambia nigeria whichever country you're in use this virtual address they have given you when registering on websites in the us okay so now we go back home uh, so this is my Quacha balance. If I want to load this balance into the card, all I need to do is click on cards. Once it has opened up, I'm going to scroll up and come here where it says uh, fund this card. So you enter in the dollar amount you want to fund it with. In this case, it's $25. And uh, it's going to come to that much Quacha. It tells you how much Quacha, the exchange rate it's using and all. Then you just simply click on confirm. So once you've confirmed, your card balance gets automatically updated. So now there's $97 balance in the card. So let me go on to Amazon and show you how to link this card to an American website like Amazon. Okay, so I'm going to use Amazon as an example. Simply go here under your account. Once you've opened that up, you simply come here where it says your payments. You might It might prompt you to uh, log in again. Just simply enter your password. If it brings you this way, you have to receive an SMS and uh, activate a link. Simply do that. Once you've done that, you come here to payments. This is where you can add remove cards. In this case, I'll show you how to add a butter card. So once you click on the add debit credit card, it's going to ask you for the card number and name on card. The card number is simply your full 16 digit butter card. The expiry date is going to be there on your virtual card. So this is your card number. Simply copy that. Your name should be your name as it appears there. Do not use third party names. And the billing address is this US address. So billing address and delivery address are separate things. So simply put the billing address when prompted. It won't deliver your parcels to the billing address. It's just for purposes of billing. Okay, so once you have set up your card, uh, we can test it out by doing some actual shopping. So I need to get uh, an Amazon gift card for somebody. Someone sent me some money to get an Amazon gift card. So once you've scrolled up, click on the gift or the gift card or whichever item you're purchasing. If it's a gift card, you can simply select the amount 
or you can manually input the amount at the end so i'm sending an 80 dollar amazon gift card once i enter in the amount it's an 80 dollars that i'm sending Uh, you can simply, or you also need to enter in the email address of the recipient. Once you've done all of that, you can go straight to buy now. You don't even need to go to the cart, add to cart or anything, just buy now. And here it's going to show you your order. Just make sure that the billing address is correct. The delivery address, if it's a physical product, should be where the goods are are being sent to do not send to your billing address send to your actual address but the billing address should be that okay so the order is done it has been placed and i'll show you some of my order history okay so i've ordered a number of gift cards if you need a gift card ordered just get in touch you now i've ordered a number of gift cards so this one has been submitted it takes about five minutes for it to be sent and those are some of the other gift cards I've sent. Uh, this one was received. Uh, that pen was ordered. So basically, you can use your Barter virtual card to order from Amazon. So just remember the simple basic rule. Your billing address is this virtual US address that you have been given. So anyway, uh, you can let me know in the comments if there's anything that I missed in this video. Anything you'd like me to make on the butter virtual cards or even the butter by flutterwave app itself and i shall make that video anyways thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video follows bye